Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. The easiest way to get to your email and calendar is to use the web interface. Logging in. Go to webmail.stanford.edu. On Stanford's web authentication page, enter your Sunnet ID and password and then click login. Your mail inbox appears. Take our lead. Two years. About four months after you graduate, Stanford automatically forwards your at stanford.edu mail to your alumni email address. The university keeps this forwarding in place for two years. Stanford also forwards mail for GSB alumni to their GSB alumni email addresses for two years. Let's help you make your mark. Strictly speaking, you can't do this. You can, however, create an alias for your Sunnet ID, and use the alias as your public email and web address. That way, nobody will see your Sunnet ID except you, you'll continue to use it as your login ID. Log into Stanford U. Let's help you make your mark. Email and calendar students who have Google email accounts, plus some schools and departments, can continue to use Gmail to access their at stanford.edu email and calendar. Following are additional Google Workspace applications that are available for use, Google Sheets. Make your mark, take our lead. Stanford University has a license agreement with Microsoft that provides several Microsoft products, including Office, to faculty and staff with full-service Sunnet IDs. Office applications include Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, and Outlook, plus Access and Publisher for Windows users. Take our lead. How to configure the built-in Android Mail app for Office 365. Select the setting to add an account. Select the account type. Corporate Sync or Exchange Active Sync. Enter the account information. Domain, username. Stanford.edu. Your son it id at Stanford.edu. E.g stanford.edu, jdoe at stanford.edu, password, your Sunnet ID password. Use secure connection. Selected. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.